was told about uh, we were going to London, which was a I'm going home for. This is great. That's a big thrill. I had never, I'd never been to sea before. I'd, I'd never been to Scotland before. So this was a big adventure for me. I uh, always remember there was a wee test given me by the, the chief engineer. And uh, when I was cleaning around his cabin, I seen that's 50 pence just protruding out of the bottom of the bed. Uh, I'm saying, that's 50 pence there. Yeah. And I'm saying to myself, He's left that there deliberately as like an, an honesty test, if you like. And it was up out of my sort of the table. And then I think it was the following day I heard them saying to the captain, Ah, he passed, he passed uh, uh, he, the, the 50 pence was on the table. So obviously they must have had a problem with previous cabin boys' uh, dishonesty. And this was a week kind of test they did, uh, which I passed. I always remember the Saturday, that Saturday afternoon, we got along the English Channel. And uh, the captain says this is a thing that's going to get getting in a rough but in a storm. There's a storm coming from the, the Atlantic and we were heading straight into it. And uh, it was quite again, an experience, you know, having a storm. Then the captain came up to my cabin and, and told me that you better hang on, son, this is going to get nasty. And I did get nasty. What happened? When we go to Land's End at the end of at Cornwall, we had to turn right, I feel like, heading to the Irish Sea. And at that, I exposed the, the port side of the Lady McGowan. So you just came up, we were getting, we were getting battered the side of the ship. And so we were doing this extreme rocket. Uh, and that, that lasted for hours and hours. I mean, I, I was really, I was frightened. I, could, oh, I wasn't frightened, I was terrified. Because uh, I was, I always remember, I was clinging to me, my bed. And I was looking through the porthole. Right, and you would see the sky, and then seconds later, you would, your poor hole was under the, under the waves, and this was one for years and years. And I'm lying there, sobbing for my mother, right, in terror. Uh, but obviously, and the, and the noise, obviously, you could, you could hear things, you know, banging away and clattering. And so it was a, a quite a violent storm we, we were caught up in, which was, was totally new to me, I'm saying. I'm lying, I said, <laughs> how did I get here?